and COVID-19 has halted mass events in St. Lucia and the Sister Isles. Carnival celebrations have not been held since 2019. However, St. Lucia is joining Dominica and Grenada in taking the festivities virtual in what has been dubbed the Trifecta Carnival. Jesse Leos reports. Plans for the branding and commercialization of Carnival in St. Lucia, Dominica and Grenada as a triune product are well advanced. The Trifecta Carnival is being described as an experience-driven, creative commercial product created for the three island showcases that offer the patrons the opportunity to immerse themselves at varying levels and price points across the three distinct Caribbean carnivals. The experience promises a transformative ritual of three carnivals that, when completed once or several times over the three-year duration of the program, will unleash positive energy into the world. Three carnivals, one ritual. Love, party, power. Join the ritual. Mass Dominic and Dominica delivering the love, St. Lucia Carnival delivering the party, and Spice Mass delivering the power in Grenada. Export St. Lucia is facilitating this trifecta offering. Senior client manager on the project, Anthony John, provided an update during a recent panel discussion to sensitize the public on this synergistic effort. The project is at a stage where we have at the joint marketing initiatives where each, each participating country, St. Lucia, Dominica and Grenada, they have to do come up with one event that would promote the carnival in those three free country territories. We are at the stage where we are about to unveil a jingle promoting the free carnivals. Um, at the national level, each country, each agency would be doing some promotional and marketing activities at the national level to ensure that persons home and abroad get to get on board with the project mm -hmm. and get to know what's happening. Um, they are at the stage where we commission of some social media marketing okay. and also promotion at the national level at items or areas in which the, the, the countries or the organizations seem fit for their respective um, entities. All three carnivals have undergone extensive exercise to improve their commercialization, branding, and intellectual property protection. The trifecta offering is one prong of the commercialization that cements the success of this overall initiative financed by the Caribbean Development Bank through its Cultural and Creative Industries Innovation Fund. Joining the panel virtually from Barbados was Bank Facility Coordinator Dr. Mariel Barrow-Magnon. Given the current moment with many of our carnivals on pause due to COVID-19, it is indeed prescient to carefully consider how carnivals will evolve going forward. We are very, very proud of the output produced by Export St. Lucia, their Dominican and Grenadian partners, and Accela Marketing. Indeed, as you have just witnessed, the branding and marketing strategy and intellectual property toolkit produced are of high caliber and great utility not only to the partners, but as a model for our 19 borrowing member countries at the Caribbean Development Bank. All three bodies responsible for Carnival in the participating islands are enthusiastic about the collaborative marketing initiative. Colin Pipe, Chief Executive Officer of the Discover Dominica Authority, was also on hand virtually to share his expectations for Mass Dominic through this venture. We are primarily... Um patronized by the Dominica diaspora. Uh, and one of the things that we want to do and why we're particularly thrilled with this um, initiative is that we expect that this will give us additional exposure to the, the, the carnival goers, so to speak, the, the, the community of people who go to carnivals in different islands. And that by partnering with St. Lucia and Grenada and getting a different um, set of eyes looking at Dominica's carnival. It will all go well for us in terms of attracting now some of these carnival goers to what is a new and different or rather a different carnival experience. Organizers are also reporting buy-in from the stakeholders in each population. Chief Executive Officer of the Spice Mass Corporation in Grenada, Kelvin Jacob, emphasized that the success of the trifecta is predicated on addressing the concerns of stakeholders. The ideas that came from that um, sort analysis, a lot of it came from our stakeholders. And we would have to pay a lot of attention to the 
the weaknesses especially pointed out in that sort of analysis. We say that it came from our stakeholders and listen to what they are saying there and really try to work and improve in that to get them to be happier with what the products that we are, we are giving up. We know that they have, many of them have been through the process with us in that project. And there is buying, there is buying. And I think basically they're just waiting to see when we are open up again for carnival activities so that we can really work along together to execute a lot of the ideas and the plans. So as it comes to our stakeholders in green, I think they are, they are on board with us. Um, and we, they are just waiting and hoping that we can actually pull off a carnival very soon. In addition to the impression that the trifecta has on patrons, organizers also hope to utilize the transformation to attract investors to further enhance the carnival product. For the Government Information Service, I am Jesse Leons reporting.